Hey guys, welcome back to S Motorsports. Uh, before I get started, I want to make sure to make sure to hit that subscribe button and smash that like button. Uh, that definitely helps me out, helps the channel out, uh, lets me know that you guys like what I'm doing, uh, as well as so you don't miss any new content on the Camaro. So today I got an easy interior upgrade. We're gonna do some knee bolsters and knee pads. Let's take a look at what I got. I picked up some uh, some new or used knee bolsters on eBay. Hold on, they're packaged really good. So I just kept browsing eBay. Uh, I was looking on the sixth gen forums as well. And I think the guy actually had them posted on both sites, um, but I found them on eBay and it was just easier to order them with PayPal and everything. But um, he packaged them very nice. Um, they, and what I picked up was just the original um, leather ones with the white gray stitching. As you can see, they look and you know, they look absolutely brand new. So here's the, uh, one of the center console ones. As you can see, these also look in great shape. Only a couple clips holding these in. So should be a pretty easy swap out and I think this is going to dress up the interior a little bit instead of just the uh, plastic ones that come with the 1LE. They're pretty uh, pretty basic. They look, I mean, they work fine, but your knee is, you know, with being a little uh, taller, um, your knee does touch that um, spot and I think it will just dress up the interior a little bit, give a little bit more contrast right there to the center console. So let's take a look at what it originally looks like. Again, got the door panels as well. All right, so you should just be able to put a little pressure on this and push it right up. Oh yeah, that was super easy. And the new one just slides back into the two tabs that are right here. Line them up. So they start going in, let's see, yep. And boom, that's it. Wow, that's, that's really easy. Now on the passenger side again, it should just pop up. Pops right out. There we go. All right, next we gotta pop, this is the passenger side door, we gotta pop this off of the knee pad. I'm gonna just try pulling first. See if I can get behind it. Oh, there we go. There we go. All right, and then the new one should just pop right back on. You just line up the clip holes. Pop it back into place. Now the driver's door, again, to see if you can get it started on one end. There we go. All right, you can kind of see, here's the plastic one. You know, it's just, it just looks nicer with the stitching on there. Gives it a little bit more detail. Goes on the exact same. These pop off and on really easy. But let's put the last uh, driver side on and take a look how all of them look in the car then. Driver side again just gets popped in. Line up the clips. And it just pops in. That simple. All right guys, so I think it looks pretty good. All right, let's shut the door. Oh, you know, one thing I just just did is I grabbed the door, you know, you grab right here to shut the door. 
It's actually a nicer feel on the hand as well. You're like you're not not grabbing plastic. Uh, so I, that's kind of nice. Added benefit. So as you can see, you know, I'm 6'3", I'm pretty tall. So my knees do touch this surface quite often. So that's kind of why I wanted these. I think that uh, they look better, one, two, um, my knee does touch it as well as this side. I do rest my knee up against that a lot just because my legs are so long. But uh, yeah, it just it just gives the car a really a good look. It's just an easy upgrade, super easy to do. As you can see, it just ties everything. I wanted the the leather because it just kind of ties in the Recaro seats and uh, you know the uh, stitching that was already on the car that comes with the One SS. Just kind of ties everything together. I know a lot of people do the suede. I think the suede would look really good as well. Um, it just, it's more maintenance as well, which I'm probably gonna have another video coming out on I wanna clean the steering wheel as well as the shifter. These are pretty, the shifter is pretty matted down as well as the steering wheel, especially in this area, um, cause you're grabbing here and then you got your other hand on the shifter. So this area is really matted down. I wanna get this cleaned up and make this look fresher. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss uh, kind of any new videos coming out on the Camaro. I know I got got to do some driving videos. It is getting a little chillier out, so I got to get some drives in while I can. But I uh, hope you enjoy the content and uh, give me a big thumbs up. All right. Thanks, guys. Till next time.